This pattern is number 13 in Pritt's book and is the third of the March Brown patterns. The dressing calls for a body of orange silk dubbed with fox ear fur. And for this fly, I'm using a vintage spool of Purcell's gossamer and again, a light orange or a gold as we would call it now. For the dubbing, he uses the fur taken from a fox's ear. And this is quite common in many of the wharftail patterns at least. They utilize a lot of fur from the fox's ear and it's a very long and fine stapled fur. So it's very easy to dub with. The hackle is one of these beautifully marked overcovered feathers taken from the outside of a woodcock's wing. To dress the fly, we trap in our silk just behind the eye of the hook with four or five nice tight touching turns. You can see here, I like to leave a small gap between my tying silk and the eye of the hook. This is simply because it will produce a smaller head to the fly when I come to finish it. Now using the tag end of silk as a guide, we bring our tying silk down the hook shank in nice, tight, touching turns. Personally, I like to come down to a point just where the hook point is before cutting off that tag end of silk. Now with my tying silk, I come a further distance down the hook shank, burying that small tag and leaving my tying silk somewhere between the point of the hook and the end of the barb. Now we take our fox's ear and we just strip off a very small amount of the dubbing. And because it's a nice and long and soft staple dubbing, it goes onto the tine silk without any problems at all. Now in tight touching turns, we bring our dubbed silk back up the hook shank. Now with our woodcock hackle, we simply strip back the hackles to expose the tip. Then taking our scissors, we just trim that tip down to a nice manageable length. Now simply trap it in on top of the hook shank with three or four nice firm wraps of silk. Before bringing our scissors and trimming off any excess tag. Now with the hackle pliers, simply push back a little bit of the hackle to start off with and then wrap our hackle in a nice even and symmetrical plane to the hook shank. As with most of my March Brown patterns, I like to take an extra turn of hackle. So for me, three, possibly three and a half turns of hackle is just right. Once you're happy with that hackle density, come in with your silk and trap down that stalk with two nice, tight, firm wraps of silk. Come in with your scissors and trim off the waist end. Before taking your whip finish tool and making a two 
or free turn whip finish. Trim off the silk and there you have Pritz number 13 March Brown. <laughs> <laughs>